ground data yep. um, outside to melt the So ice. this is an avalanche board. And the first thing we're going to do is put down some very weak base layers. This is called depth hoar. Okay, and we're going to pour it all in here. Come on, Stella, you want to help? Yeah, can you give me some? No, come over here. Can you, you can do it. So this is some other snow mixed in. This is uh, this is a bit of our base layer. I'm getting more. So then we have a great big Utah snowstorm, and we have a lot of snow coming down. Lots, lots, lots. of snow. Lots and lots of snow. And this is. Good sticky snow, and it's falling on top of lots of rotten, weak snow. Lots. So now we have the, boy. the, the boy. boy's all gone. Okay, you hold the boy, he's the trigger. So what don't do anything with him. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, so now we're going to tip it up. And these are the different angles. There's 0, 15, 30, 35, 45, 60. And the prime angle is 38 degrees. Okay, we're going to tip it up and see what happens. Uh-oh. Right at 38 degrees. Look at the And that's how avalanches happen. Looks what happened. We have a great big crown line all the way along here, and it went down and it hit all the cars and all the kids. <laughs> Leave it there, man. Yeah, see? And that's because we have very weak snow and then strong snow on top of it. And see, Mira, stop. See how dangerous it is? It wiped out all the cars and it took out and buried all of these people. And if these were real people, they'd be in trouble, right? I want to put the boy in. Yep, and the boy got buried. That happens quite a bit.